Hi Church, today we're praying for Audacious Foundation and all of the communities that are represented across all of our campuses and locations and as you know as a church we're passionate about supporting our local communities and providing practical solutions to some of the challenges that are faced by people who are vulnerable in our communities. And for the last several years, we've been uh, focusing on supporting uh, in five key areas, issues around homelessness, healthcare, education, employment and family challenges. So not only can we pray into those five areas today, but we've also um, come up with some themes and scriptures that will help guide your prayers for the foundation today and over the next year. So let's allow the Holy Spirit to lead us and, uh, and inform us as we pray today. And the first thing that we would love for you to pray into is for all of those who are struggling in our communities and uh, in particular for those who are uh, most vulnerable. Psalm 9 verse 18 says God will never forget the needy and the hope of the afflicted will never perish and uh, our prayer really is that people would know God's hand in their lives even through the most difficult of situations and use us to be a blessing to those people. The second thing is for us to pray for our teams, for people who serve in Audacious Foundation projects and other community-led projects across Audacious. Psalm 41 verse 1 says, Blessed is those, are those who have regard for the weak. The Lord delivers them in times of trouble. So we're praying for our teams that they would know God's hand and God's goodness in their lives as well as the people that we support. The third thing that we would love for you to pray into today is for influence and favour across our cities through partnerships with schools, businesses in civic society. We're uh, praying and believing that there's going to be favour in all of those areas. We've been thinking about Psalm 45 and in verse 12 it says, the city of Tyre will come with a gift and people of wealth will seek your favour. And that's what we believe for Audacious Church and for our foundation, that we will re receive the favour and the blessing of people and uh, uh, and the city, people in our city. So let's pray for favour and influence in that today. And the final thing, we would love for you to pray into new opportunities for growth and for the resources to do what we believe that God has called us to do, to make a difference in our community. Isaiah 43 verses 18 and 19 say, forget the former things, do not dwell on the past. See, I am doing a new thing. Now that it springs up, do you not perceive it? I am making a way in the wilderness and streams in the wasteland. And we believe that 2024 is going to be one of great influence and growth. And as God uh, increases our capacity and also our hearts, that we're able to serve in a greater measure those people who are vulnerable in our community so on behalf of the team we want to thank you so much for standing with us in prayer today and for your support of audacious foundation